Yeah, so that was fun. I just was taping the, the sky and stuff and realized I wasn't taping at all. Hi guys, it's Chase, and I don't get out of the house much, so when I do, I I get all happy and excited, and I just wanted to kind of take, take a view of our sky today, show you guys how pretty it is. The clouds are so neat today. And where I, when I started uh, taping, it was actually in a really pretty location, and I wanted to show you guys, but apparently I didn't hit the button right. So yeah, still getting used to this. Just want to take a picture of the sky for you, and how pretty it is. So pretty. Look at that. I'm not sure if you can see the, the mountain back there. That's where I live, on the very tippy top of the mountain. Whoa, sorry, it's bumpy. Lots of old little houses around my area. And some really neat little parks. Like back there is a little baseball diamond. More little farmhouses and barns and they're doing road construction. They're actually making a whole new road back there. 501. It's going to be part of 501. Instead of going through this little town, all the traffic, they're going to reroute it so it goes. So it skips. I love that little that little house cottage thing over there. But instead of going through this little town, it's going to reroute it so that it doesn't go through the town. And I think it'll be a lot a lot better for the people who live in this little town, you know, so that giant trucks and stuff don't have to, uh, have to, uh, you know, drive through the town. Those are some neat houses over there, some old, uh, old style houses. I just love the, the architecture of, of this little historic Schaefer's town. There's the old church really pretty. There's actually a really, a really old um, building up here that I that I love. It's, it's actually the uh, the um, bar. I'm gonna show you guys this house up here too. I really want to try to fix it up. Look at that. How neat is that house? It's so cool. Up here's the bar that I was telling you about. It's called the Franklin. It's really neat. And there's a, that used to be a, that yellow building used to be a stagecoach stop. And there's another old church. So I live in the country, and you know, just little tiny small towns. There's another neat building. Just wanted to show you guys, give you an idea of where. When I say like you know there's not there's no witchy shops around or and stuff like that, kind of because I live in this tiny you know wooded slash farmland area and uh, this is a neat little house too right there. You can see it. I'm sorry if we're going fast, but it's it's one of the main busy roads so. Why? The rolling hills and farms. Oh yeah. Oh, there's my there's the horsies out there. Horsey friends. I don't know if you've seen them or not. Hi guys. <laughs> More of the beautiful sky. So pretty. I wish I I wish I figured I could figure out how to zoom. I could zoom for ya. I'm gonna put the window back up. You can still see. What do you think, Thomas? Mm -hmm. See 
เฮด้าโอ้ it's a summertime this place here they uh that's where I get some of my produce and some of my flowers and it's really really they have really affordable prices and over there um on top of that mountain ridge thing there on the other side of that mountain there's a bigger mountain and that's where oh we got construction here and that's where I grew up um my dad and mom and everybody live over there on the other side of that mountain over there so it's very um like I said it's when you don't see mountains you see fields and farms and so I don't know if if that's what you're looking for Vanessa when you when you uh said that you want to live out in the country but to me this, I love it out here um it is kind of boring if you know but but there's plenty to do there's lots of Amish tourist stuff and then you know it's like a half hour and you get to a city up there's the old school building up here's the old um Klein Powder Self Hotel Let me try to get that right there it's a really pretty oh sorry guys it's a really pretty building now we're getting out to uh projects. The people in my area call it the projects, but when I lived in other cities and, I mean, not other cities, like in cities, the projects, when I told people that I lived near the projects, they thought that I was talking about, you know, like a ghetto, like run down part of the city, and that's not the case because this is definitely not the projects. If you're talking about that kind of thing, it 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 was a state project. Um, it's called Middle Creek Wildlife Management Area, and there's lots of like bodies, like little ponds and woods, and they have um, see there's a pond there, and then there's over there's another pond. There's the mountains in the background I was talking to you guys about. And uh, it was actually a state project where they turned a bunch of land that, you know, was basically just sitting there. They, I mean, they wanted to they wanted to save the natural the natural way the land around here, I guess, looked, and um, they turned it into a wildlife management area. Oh, there's a little farmhouse up there and some sheep. And there's uh, the snow geese. People come from all over to come out to the Middle Creek Wildlife Management Area for the snow geese, and and uh, thousands of them. It's actually that time of year. Um, I think next month is when they come. The, the snow geese all come out. Yeah, and more fields. See, yeah, I'm used to this um, area and scenery, and you know, I have friends from from other states and stuff that, when they came out here, like other parts of the you know United States and other parts of the world, when they came out here, they were you know telling me how beautiful it was and you know how how neat you know the hills and the trees and the little farms like old farms tucked away farms are and when you live around places like, you know, where you, where you, where you grow up, you're, you're used to it, so, all right, guys, well, I'm going to get going here, I just wanted to, there's another little pond, and this little neat farm, farmhouse, old farmhouse there, I love it, I'm going to let you go, uh, just thought maybe you'd want to see where I'm coming from, and maybe I'll take a, of uh outside view of of my my actual house you know in the when I get up on the mountain because some of you guys want to know you know where I live so alrighty have a good day thanks for watching bye bye.